What's up? Hey, so this is the Masters PDR Guild. Uh, this. Oh, we did offend a lot of people in the last video. Yeah, we, you no, know what? No more Hillary. I'm going to look straight no in the Hillary. camera. We're no, look no more Hillary. No more Obama. No more China. No more Hillary going to jail stuff. Oh, I like all that. <laughs> it's gotten kind of ridiculous, but... But if we're actually up, up, up in the pay level of, you know, doctors and attorneys and, and surgeons... Training, too, that are done in a small one-on-one -on -one or two-on-one environment. But that's not what we're here to talk about today. That's well, not going to help him. Why those, would, those kind of guys could possibly make it. It, it just depends. But I'm five years old. Well, I'm saying. I mean, that's look. There's a 76 year old Russian guy that completely the right. True. But the right angle on the right camera, you can see ten times more than they can. Eye. And I agree with that's both correct. sides. I agree with that's both correct. sides. Uh, and you know, I can show you a dent under the right lighting and everything. Hail damage on a roof. I can show before and after just by moving sure. the light. And I never even touched a dent. But it looks like it's done. Right. Well, what, I, what I'm getting at, though, Michael, and this, I had one of the guild members uh, who was talking about this <laughs> yesterday with me, and he said, you know, he said, uh, I've seen some of these, you know, guys that are, I've seen their work in the field, and it looks nothing like what the video pan uh, evidence that we see on social media. He goes, their dents are not finished. And he said, and I want people to know that that's okay. <laughs> It's still got, but he goes, I, I think there's some misrepresentation that there's like pixie dust is an actual, actual term he used. Like and, he and, goes, they're not as nice as they're led to, I'm not saying it's intentional, but how they look on the internet. But he said, I, that's okay. And he said, I, but I think people need to know that they're not all going to be glassed. He goes, there's sometimes where, and this is a 25 year tech that does more movie star cars and high dollar cars out on the West coast than anybody I know. Okay. And it's not anybody that hardly anybody here has heard of. But he's the real deal. And I met him when I was out, when I lived in California in the late 90s. But I'm just saying, one of his things is he wants to show the reality of this. That, hey, there still is going to be maybe a little bit of a stretched metal here. But how are you quoting your customer? Are they happy? So that's, it's not that everything all. is perfect. Do you understand? And 99.9% .9 of the body <laughs> shop <laughs> stuff that comes out of there, <laughs> come on, is not perfect. No, you no, see the crap not. that these, some no. of these body shops are getting away with? Yeah. I, I mean, do. I do. We have we're held to a way higher standard. There was a there was a uh, uh, some images of a uh, someone gave a guy a four or five star review, and then they posted the before and after images on a review system on the internet. It'll make it'll make the I mean, it's absolutely terrible. Looks like the guy took a hammer and beat the snot out of the dent, and the customer was happy. Okay. Well, again, I'm like, if, if you, you <laughs> met if you met that point of contact where that customer was looking for X amount. And the dollar number hit them right, and you told them whatever, and you always aired more on the side of caution. You know, you told them 60 or 70. All right, God bless you, whatever that is. I mean, I, my own personal deal is I walk away from stuff that is less than that I can myself can be proud of, but I understand the market out there. Oh, the market. Uh, look at the My gas. mom couldn't see a dent this big, but if I put a smudge on a window, she used to clean houses. She'd be like, you right. fingerprinted my window. Right. I'm like, you can't see a dent the size of a pipe plate on your car. Right. How's that possible? Do you know what I'm saying? It, but if you take if you take some of the news articles that are on YouTube, look them up, and look up dent fraud or dent warnings or whatever, okay. and you actually pay attention and look at what these customers actually paid. Hundreds of dollars for. Hundreds more hundreds. than. <laughs> I was like. I know. I was like I probably would have charged a hundred and. $50 for that dent, and that guy got 400 I'm like, and he... has got toothpaste on it that's curing out when we're done. Drywall. Right. <laughs> Let that cure, so, you know, yeah. the sun cures. Yeah. It's better hey, than... Hey, whoever did the video on the spray thing, put it on YouTube. Blast it out there. Sell it. Just sell it and put... Don't, it doesn't work. You're going to be a millionaire. Phenomenal job in a video. <laughs> Phenomenal job in a video. If you got the pops of dent at AutoZone, I mean, come on. Yeah. Put the spray dent removal yeah. out there. You are a millionaire. That's right. And just put does not work. See, because we've learned on the internet that sales are more important than skills. That was a survey. Well, yeah, yeah I think uh, Abraham Lincoln said you don't, you got to believe in everything on the internet anyway. So. Right, yeah. right. I mean, I guess and he was in on kind of the early days of the internet, like 1861, I think, before Al Gore. And I don't think Al ever gave Abe Lincoln props for the internet research he did. That was the first thing on the internet was the Emancipation Proclamation. 
an AFI out about in Texas. That's how for two they years. knew. That's how all the people knew that the war was over. Abe Lincoln got on the interwebs, as uh, Richard Rawlings calls them on Gas Monkey, and then all of the people that were slaves found out on the internet. Now, we did offend a lot of people in the last video. You know, we, you no, know what? no more Hillary. I'm going to look straight no in the Hillary. camera. No, look no more Hillary. No more Obama. No more China. No more Hillary going to jail stuff. Oh, I like all that. <laughs> but anyways, look, we, no some of you, no some of you guys I mean, took we, this personal, and, talk, and some of you even misunderstood some of our jokes. Yeah. We are not no. bagging or digging on you. You guys are yeah. very successful. You're doing, you found a niche of the market. We're finding another niche of the market, so we're not competing. We don't wake up in the morning thinking about you. I don't ever wake up with an insurance company the first thought of the day, you know, I'm a hail guy going, Man, I wonder how much money I can save the insurance company today. Let me tell you what I did. I, I want to wake up and know that I can have do a good job for my family, turn out a nice job. I do it as under the Lord, but I'm not. It is what it is. So I, I if you old, think we're old. talking about you right now, we're not talking about you. I had, I had an old man tell me one time. Okay. And this was years ago. He said, if you, have, if you go to bed worrying about something... And you wake up worrying about the same situation and problem. Somebody's renting space in your head. Get rid of it. Yeah. I woke up. I, I mean, I, I went to bed one night thinking about a guy that worked for me. Bad things happened. I woke up next morning and I fired him. Period. I mean, you're gone. I'm done. I don't want to go to bed thinking about you. I'm not going to. I'm right. Like, a man I, shouldn't I got, go to bed thinking about another man, though. Oh, you didn't mean it that way. You meant like the workplace. Period. And if 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 I if I'm allowing something else to right. consume, getting it free consume rent space me, in your head. I, I can't. So let me tell you. I got five kids. I love every one of them. I got a beautiful wife, and uh, that I got my time has to be there. Sure. Not, I mean, I but I want to give back, and I've always been. Uh, I always wanted to give back. Always want to get back to the industry. I get back everywhere I can. So that's what we're going to do with this guild. You're going to see some people that you haven't heard of because maybe some of the newfangled stuff has kind of gone over the guys that have been around this industry for 25 years or so. So you're going to see some different perspectives. You're going to see things that you think are new that have been being done since, well, I'll tell you this, and it's not a, not a pat on the back to me. Everybody's all excited about the mini lights. Okay, well, I had a mini light with a cordless battery operated three inch fade in 1992 with rail railvac rechargeable batteries. First person, if you told me you have a mini light before 1992, I want to see pictures of it. So the cordless stuff isn't new, but you know what? It comes out and social media has made it now where everything looks new. Dude. And there is some better mouse traps. <laughs> I get that, but you know what? Line boards have been out, right. wooden mallets, you, blending hammers have been out since the like in 2006, 50s. 2006, I saw my first line board. Yeah. Look, I, uh, I ran into a guy at a dealership. He was using a line board. I walked up and saw the debt he was working on. And I, have, and I was running a, um, uh, I think the old halogen, breaking a bulb every two weeks. Sure. In sure. the back of the truck. But uh, I, as soon as I saw that line board, I saw areas of the dent moving that I had never seen before. And I went home that night, and then, I, I mean, I became friends with the technician, uh, and we are still, and he's a phenomenal tech. Absolutely sure. phenomenal sure. tech. Uh, I, I ended up looking on the internet, I talked to my buddy, I ended up becoming friends with the guy, so I ended up talking to him, and I, he said, hey, do you hear about that new light that came out? And I was like, no, he told me about it, and dude, I came home, and I spent $650 that night on that dent light. And you know what, I don't think I'd spent $50 in sure. 10 years on tools? <laughs> sure, sure. Yeah, well, there uh, is that guy. There's uh, that. But there's dude, but there's that, some of us. freaking light just changed. And then I went to the bigger one. The, 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 I mean, there's phenomenal tools. The, the technology. But you don't need that to start. No. I mean, but... But let me let me explain this. It's going to make a lot of you mad when I say this. So I'm going to beat your tool company up because no, I'm, I'm a big fan. I'm of going to make some people all. mad here because people think I'm a prima donna anyway, but they've never met me. I'm nothing like the what people say I am behind my back. So, anyways, at least if you're going to hate me, give me a chance. Like meet me, shake my hand, find out, find out that I'm funny, find out oh, that. Oh, by I'm, the way, I scheduled a set down for you. 
Uh, we ain't got the date yet, but I'll let you know. Okay. So let me explain this, and this will hurt people's feelings, but let's say there's a hundred rungs on the ladder of PDR. Okay. None of us have made it to the top because there isn't a top that any of us can probably attain. It's, it just keeps going with and as soon different we, things. As soon as we do, the bar gets raised. As soon as we do, right. we got my little, all aluminum cars. But here's the problem with the internet. And out there, and some of us that have been doing it kind of giggle like, what happens what is, during birth? Yeah. A baby comes out. Freaking mess. Oh, it's disgusting. It's a mess. I did not even want to I, I, I've been through explore five my wife ever so, again after seeing uh, what dude, happened. Shut up about that. There are some people, there are a lot of companies out there. We're in the birthing stage. Up that, what I'm saying is, though, you can do that car for $7,000, or you can uh, show the insurance company the actual consumer law and get a check for $31,000.